Okay, two minutes of truth this Sunday and not two minutes of opinions and multiplication of opinions. I explain why I would like to bring to your attention something really important for Christians who are supposed to follow Jesus, the way and the truth and the life. We are listening this fifth Sunday of Easter when Jesus at the last discourse gave them the last secrets before dying. When we die, we want to tell the one we love the most important things of our life. And often children ask their parents, their grandma, do you have a last word of wisdom for my life? Something really important for you that I need to keep during all my life. And you can be sure that 30 years later, you will remember those words. So we are reading the beginning of chapter 14. And you know about COVID-19 about politics, about politicians and their statements. What is true? What belongs to opinion only? Thousands of you, you have been surfing the web to hear the very conspirational theories behind COVID-19. And I'm not going to look at all those people who all have their theories about what is true about the origin of COVID-19, about the big political plan. But what can we know of the truth? We can waste hours a week going from one website to another, one YouTube video to another. But remember, the Christian doesn't feed himself by opinions, but by the truth and only by the truth. And Jesus said in the Gospel, I am the way and the truth and the light. So let's spend time more on our knees, praying and listening to Jesus, the truth and the way and the life. God bless you all.